Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Canna Campbell. Today I want to share with you five fast, frugal, super delicious and healthy snacks that help save me money. Now, I don't know about you, but snacking is my love language. I love to buy snacks for myself and I love to buy snacks for my loved ones. However, whenever I do this, I burn through so much money. I waste a whole pile of money. Money that could be going towards my financial goals, be going towards my financial well-being, my long-term financial well-being. So today's video, I wanted to share with you five fast, frugal, super healthy and delicious snacks that I make myself for myself and my family to help myself save money as well as my family members. All right, first up is these bacon and egg muffins. Now these are so easy to make and they're delicious. They're also zero waste and they also get a whole pile of vegetables into my children. Literally, you grab a couple of eggs, whisk them up, add some salt and pepper any vegetables that you might have sitting in the fridge. Here I've added a tiny bit of bacon and some pumpkin, put some cheese on top and then popped it into the oven using these silicon zero waste containers. Now, 10 minutes later, they are good to go and these can actually be frozen. So if you make a whole big batch, you know, cooking in bulk, you can use these to help save you money well throughout the week and month. Also, I should point out they're high in protein, so they're gonna fill you up for so much longer. So you're definitely not gonna to want to snack. Next up is my trail mix. Now, I can buy a huge bag of trail mix from Woolworths, like 500 grams, for $6. And this will last me literally for months. All I've done is downsized it into one of these metal containers from Ikea. And literally, I pop this into my handbag or in the car, and I've always got a frugal, delicious, high protein snack no matter where I am. Now, I'll share with you another little hack, and that is to smash up some dark chocolate and add it in here. So whenever I know I've got a bit of a sugar craving about to kick in, I can just sneakishly pick out the dark chocolate in this. And this will save me so much money and last me for months. My third frugal delicious uh, snack, and that has got to be banana bread. Now, if you've been following me for a long time now, you know how much I love banana bread. I can't walk past a cafe without getting banana bread. I love it toasted with lots of butter. However, again, this is a huge waste of money. Normally, one slice alone of banana bread is at least $5. Now recently, by using my Thermomix, I've been making my own banana bread. And I throw raspberries in there and chocolate chips and all sorts of things. I make them into mini banana breads. They're really fast and so delicious. But because this video is for busy people, because I know how hard the juggle is when you're time poor and how easy it is just to throw money at the problem and buy food on the go, I wanted to share this hack with you. Now, Harris Farm, as well as many other fantastic supermarkets, sell banana bread. This was less than $4, and sometimes I even managed to buy it for as little as $2.50, and there are multiple slices in this. This probably represents about $30 worth of banana bread in, in a cafe. What a ridiculous conversion. But the great thing about this is I can take it home, unwrap it, slice it up, butter it as much as butter as I like, no judgment here, and then obviously pop it into the freezer. Now, in the morning when I wake up, I know that I've got a busy day ahead of me and I'm gonna be hungry and I don't wanna waste money on snacks. I literally grab one, pop it in my handbag, and it takes less than an hour to defrost. Now, this brand makes a whole range of different flavors, and obviously you can make your own banana bread, which I highly recommend. But play with the ingredients so that there's always a great variety in your life. You can do mango, you can do coconut, you can do chopped chips, you can do pear. There are no limitations as to what you can put in your banana bread. In fact, if you make banana bread, let me know what you love to add into your banana bread. My fourth frugal and super healthy, high protein, very low carb snack has got to be cucumber and tuna, I guess you could say canapes even. Now all I've done is sliced up some cucumber, got a can of tuna which you can buy in bulk and we all know that when you have food in a can it lasts a really long time. So I will stock up on cans of tuna when they're on special at Woolworths. I've just added a dollop of mayonnaise, a little bit of Spanish onion which I've cut up into teeny tiny pieces for a bit of extra flavor and then I've topped it off with a 
optional doll of avocado which i have purchased from the odd bunch so that i'm supporting the farmers and saving money at the same time now i made two rounds of this snack and let me show you what is actually left over i still have a full container of tuna and mayonnaise and spanish onion i also have large amount of cucumber left over and of course more avocado and Spanish onion. So I can repurpose this and use this to make maybe a tuna sandwich for lunch tomorrow or even a tuna salad for dinner tomorrow. So you can really see I'm stretching out the use from the foods that I choose to buy to help me save money. It's about shopping mindfully. And then saving the best for last and that has got to be my chia pudding. I absolutely love this snack and you can eat this any time of day so easy but you do need to make it the night before literally grab some black chia seeds throw some milk into a clear container and shake it up now i add some frozen berries which i buy in bulk from woolworths because they last throughout the year it's a great way of getting vegetables and fruits into your body in a frugal manner now literally throw the uh, berries in here i like my chia pudding to be quite rich and creamy so i will add whilst it's setting some rich creamy yogurt and then I pop it into the fridge overnight. Now when I wake up in the morning I'm good to go. I can literally pull this out of the fridge and it's good to go but you can also add other things on top of your chia pudding such as banana, granola, muesli. I love to add clusters. You can add obviously honey and cinnamon. You can really mix things up just like you would with your banana bread so that you never get bored of these snacks and you continue on saving money along the way. Now there you have it, five fast, frugal, delicious and healthy snacks to help you save money. Now I would love to hear from you guys as to what you like to make at home to save money that's also fast, easy to make because obviously the less ingredients you have the better, the more savings they're going to be. So please make sure you subscribe to my channel, let me know what you think of this video and if you'd like me to share more frugal fast ingredients and recipes with you. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next Thursday. Ciao for now.